A female Battle Creek officer who has had previous problems with alcohol is now charged with driving drunk. Jennifer Apple is also accused of carrying a firearm while intoxicated. 25 News 8 Steve Kelso is joining us now with what you've uncovered today, Steve. Yeah, this all happened Saturday night when Jennifer Apple's co-workers noticed the smell of alcohol on her breath at the very beginning of her overnight shift. They asked her to submit to an alcohol test, which she did willingly, and then officers from Battle Creek Police called the Michigan State Police. Now, the Battle Creek Police blood test showed, or I should say portable breathalyzer test, showed her alcohol level at 0.13. MSP administered a breathalyzer test several hours later, and she registered 0.07. Now, that's not legally drunk, but because of the time that it passed, Prosecutor Dave Gilbert tells me this afternoon that it is logical to assume that her BAC was higher earlier. Jennifer Apple has had alcohol-related problems in the past. In July of 2012, Apple was a passenger in a drunk driving crash. That car was driven by an off-duty officer, William Gensch. Her BAC at that time was .369. Since she was off-duty at the time, she was not disciplined. Also in May of 2012, she lied about not being able to show up to work because she said she was too embarrassed to admit that she'd been hospitalized due to alcohol. At that point, she was suspended for 15 days. Her future with her employment with the department now is in question tonight. Late this afternoon, Battle Creek Police Chief Jackie Hampton told me he will not be making any further statements regarding the four-year officer's future until an internal investigation is complete. Apple tonight remains on paid, minute, on paid administrative leave. She could be arraigned tomorrow. Marlon.